Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Rick with Stumps, and I'm here today playing more No Man's Sky, and... I need to ascend to the stars, because last episode, I found this monolith, and... Uh, got some more information on the Atlas, got a free warp cell, so the Atlas wants me to go find it. That's what we're gonna do. Uh, of course, we're not gonna find the Atlas this episode. But we are going to do another warp. So, let's go ahead and get off this planet. Come on. A little farther now. There we go. And we're into space now. And now that I'm in space, I should be able to warp. Let's go ahead and pull up in my map. All right now, all right. What is this big red? Have I been to that big red area there? Atlas interface. That about. Atlas interface. We need to go there. Okay, there we go. Hyperdrive has no fuel. Oh, we need fuel for the hyperdrive. I, I have fuel for the hyperdrive. I just haven't fueled it up yet. Let's go ahead and fuel that baby up. We are hyperdrive. Charge. Warp cell. Beautiful. And here we are. Okay, Atlas Interface. That's where we gotta go. Let's go ahead and engage. Warping right along. Whoa! Okay, whoa! You just... Co okay, there it is. There's the Atlas Interface. That thing looks familiar. Okay, and we're gonna arrive in 33 seconds. Let's go ahead and speed this, this thing up. Come on. What the hell is this? Atlas interface, very interesting. Okay, it's opening up. If this is just another space station, I'm gonna be upset. Oh, this is not just another space station. What the what? Very, very interesting indeed. I just learned the Viking word for gas. That's weird. Okay. Um, okay, what does this thing do? Let's see. What is happening? What is happening? It is alien unlike anything I've ever seen before. I should be afraid, but an inexorable pull draws me towards the heart of the construct. A need to know. This is a remnant of the Atlas. It welcomes me. It knows what I am. It offers the promise of the true understanding. The intent burns in me. I will peer into the structure of my causality and know this existence. If it is real, for some incalculably vast simulacrum authored by other intelligences. Except milestone pathfinder or above. Um, am, I, am I a pathfinder? I will accept this. The sky is deep and full of wonders, and the path to enlightenment is something or other. Okay, I have an atlas stone. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. Um, those were really expensive, last thing I, I, I remember. Can I can I go forward at all? I can't. Okay, uh, thank you for the atlas stone. Can I explore around this area some more? It seems that there are doors over there. Can I, can I go to those doors? I don't know. Let's Let's go take a little walk see here. Is that a path? It's these stones here. Oh, I don't think I can get over there. Oh, nope. Invisible wall. Invisible wall. Okay. It, it, it was nice meeting you, Atlas. Mm-hmm. Okay, now, now, we, now we boogie. Let's boogie. All 
All right, let's launch. Now that I've got this Atlas zone, I should be able to build um, an Atlas pass or something, right? Okay, let's find a station. Let's go to a station and see about building an Atlas pass. I should be able to get into areas that I haven't been able to get into before. Okay, let's see here. Uh, I see a station over there. Let's try to make it to that station if I can. Yeah, I need to get around this planet first, though. Okay, space station. Here we go. Beautiful. All right. We're at a new station. Now I just got to find out how to get inside of this station here. Around the corner, perhaps. There we go. There it is. There's the entrance. Ooh, hostile scan detected. I just uh, managed to save myself from pirates. But now I'm going to have to deal with pirates and get back out there. So I should probably upgrade my ship a bit. Okay. Now let's go see. The Atlas. Your destiny lies in the beyond. So next thing I need to do is another warp apparently. But before I do another warp, let's see about this Atlas pass. All right. Got a alien friend in here. Hello, sir. Do a little talking with you, if, if, if you don't mind. Did he call me a warrior? Oh! I've been upgraded from interloper to warrior. The downbeat life form is studying the image of another young warrior on its pad. The pictured warrior looks virile and impressive. It has facial tendrils that are outstretched. It appears rich and of good breeding stock. The look in its eyes is sultry. Oh, the life form looks to me with questioning eyes. It clearly needs someone to talk this through with. <laughs> okay, um, let's advise this guy. Haha. <laughs> Speakers throughout the facility play orchestral music. The life form shares some of the dowry it receives. Ooh, I got a jetpack booster. Cool, all right. Uh, jetpack is granted extended bursts of propulsion, allowing users to ascend to higher locations. Very cool, all right. Um, you want to talk to me again? Let's go ahead and talk again. Also, it's cold in here. Zero degrees Celsius. Why is it so cold in here? Okay, let's... Uh, oh, no, he, he called me an interloper. I take it back. The warrior's hackles rise, and it starts to shake in anticipation of my request. I sense that its ancestors are likely to be offended if I push the issue too far. Give me new words, sucker. The warrior agrees to help. And I learned the Viking word for hi. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. Now let's go ahead and see about uh, an Atlas Pass. So, actually here. Get out of here. Let's see. Atlas Pass, Atlas Pass, Atlas Pass. Craft. Um, hmm. How do I make an Atlas Pass? All right. Well, I haven't figured out how to make an Atlas Pass, but I did purchase what I need in order to make another warp cell. So now we just need to get some thomium, which should be pretty easy to get, because it's literally everywhere. All right. Warp cell is created. So now we can recharge the hyperdrive. Here we go. Hyperdrive's charged. Now we can go to this new place. Let's see here. Let's go up. Here we are. Okay. Engage. Warping one more time. Okay, there we go. Space anomaly. What are we going to discover over here? All right, let's go ahead and do a little burst. Wait, pull tensions offline. Space station in proximity. Damn it. Here we go. There we go. Anomaly. What is... Ooh, it's a round ball of some sort. It's like a Death Star. But it's not a Death Star? Oh, look at that. It's got like a, a ring around it. Weird. Okay. I'm imagining this is where I dock. Okay, I'm imagining correctly. What is this thing? 
kind of creepy. It's a little bit spooky. A little ominous. Okay, but I'm, I'm gonna go anyway. I'm, I'm gonna approach it. Okay, it opens up. What the what? <laughs> hey, this guy, he's a friendly guy. Hello. <laughs> You're kind of cute. Hello, sir. Specialist Polo. Friends everywhere, if only you know where to look. Friends in all shapes, all sizes, all... I can understand this guy. The shorter entity, a gek, has a jocular air about them. They idly wipe grease splattered hands on their suit as they address me. Some sort of engineer, maybe. To my surprise, they speak my language. Other life forms have treated me with amused indifference, but Polo treats me like an equal. They are curious about my travels, about the sentient species I have seen. If I have met other life forms, they have not. They hope that I will share my experiences. So let's go ahead and transmit the species data. Polo pours over the data, muttering bitterly at beings that they are already familiar with. They... <gasps> I got an Atlas Pass. Yes, I got an Atlas Pass. All right. And I can create it, too. Ha, ha, ha. All right. This is, uh, this is good. We wanted an Atlas Pass. We've got an Atlas Pass. Let's go ahead and create an Atlas Pass. Oh, and it only takes iron and heridium to make it? That is so easy. Okay, cool. Atlas Pass is created. Now, who's this guy? This is the first place that I've ever been to, by the way, that has more than one alien in it. So, that right there is blowing my mind. Um, hello, sir. Oh, you look like one of those people from, uh, <laughs> from, uh, Mass Effect. Hello. So, this is a priest entity, Nada. Rare linguist form. Pleasure, not a divergent Corvax. Assistance offered. Route to Galactic Core. Reconnect with Atlas for guidance. Resources for journey? Yes, no. Okay. Um, resume path. Resources to aid exploration. Find a shortcut to the center. Ooh. Find a shortcut to the center. The alien locates a black hole. Whoa! Okay, so now I've got a black hole to the center. Um, can you talk to me again, though? I, I, I want to talk again. I would like to talk again. Okay, you, you, you don't want to talk again. I understand. I understand. Can I get in this door? No, I cannot. Can I get in this door? Negative. Um, what about this door? I'm going to imagine I can't get in this door because I couldn't get into any of the other doors, but let me see. Whoa! Hey! <laughs> Whoa! New tool. Compare. Um, how does it stack up? Uh, it's pretty much the same, I would say. I, I think I'm going to stick with what I got. Yeah. Oh, it does have a plasma launcher, though. Wait, but I've got a plasma launcher. All right, I'm sticking with what I got. All right, guys. It was great meeting you. I'm just going to... I'm just going to... Wait, what about this? Can I interact with this thing? Anything with you? I cannot. All right, so now I just need some zinc. If I can get my hands on some zinc, then I can build another warp cell and we can warp away. We're just going to keep on warping. Here we are. I should be able to buy some zinc at the space station, I would imagine. If I can find out. There we go. How to get inside. There it is. Let's go ahead and dock. All right, let's get upstairs. Go talk to some aliens. See if we can purchase some zinc. Oh, also, use our Atlas Pass. Wait, where's the alien? Oh, there he is. Oh, this is a different looking station this time. Hello. Oh, let me in. Oh, you are a weird looking fella. Hello. Or lady. Oh God, you are gross looking. Sorry, I don't mean to offend, but you are disgusting. Viking High. Weapon. Hmm. The warrior's young and looks terrified. Military orders for an upcoming operation fill its terminal screen. When it sees me, its eyes widen and it drops to the floor on its knees. Proffers its multi-tool up towards me. It yelps sound pleading. The fear in its movements are more than apparent. It's so on edge that it doesn't seem aware of the security cameras that surround us watching its every move. Um... Should I take the multi-tool? Let's see. Let's see how this multi-tool stacks up. The young conscript makes preparations to abandon its post. Silent cameras record its act. What is happening with this guy? Um, okay. Let's compare here. Um, 
Yeah, it, I, once again, not as good as what I have. What does it have here? Mining Beam, Bolt Caster, uh, Rapid Fire. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to decline. You're just going to have to keep that multi-tool, buddy. Your standing of the Viking has decreased. Oh, no. Oh, no. What have you done to me? Teach me a word. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. But I still have a special relationship, so it's okay. Don't call me an interloper. Come on, man. I thought that we had something. All right, here we go. Teach me a word. You agree to help? What are you going to teach me? Your brain is showing, by the way. Okay, I learned the word for intruder. Okay, so they better have some zinc on this. There we go, zinc. Ah, oh, they have plenty of it, too. 42 units. That's what I'm talking about. I'm going to buy them all. Buy all the zinc. There we go. Perfect. Now I should be able to make my warp cell, right? Yes, yes, yes. Come on. There we go. And let's see. Wait. Don't I have antimatter? Is it in the starship? I know I made. What happened to my antimatter? I know I made antimatter. Come on. Damn it. Okay. Oh, I needed the zinc to make the antimatter. Did I? Okay. There we go. Now I should be able to. There we go. Make my warp cell. Fantastic. Okay, great. Uh, before we leave, though, let's go ahead and check out one of these doors. Because now I've got my Atlas Pass. Yeah, well, version 3. I only have version 1. Maybe this door will let me in. Come on. I want to use my Atlas Pass. Version 3. Damn it. But I have my pass. I have my pass. What about this other door on the other side? Come on. I want to feel special. I have an Atlas Pass and I want to use it. Ow. That hurt. Give me access to a door, please. Because I want to feel like a special boy. What about this one? There we go. Version 1. Ha ha. Yeah. Getting into places. What do we have here? What's in this room? Anybody? Hello? Oh, what do we have here? Ooh, a new uh, combat amplifier Sigma. I haven't been upgrading any of these things, though, but I, at least I have access to them now. And what? Ooh, oh, yeah, exosuit upgrade. What? Nice. I will buy you. Thank you. And another door. What's this door? Ow! Why? 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 Why am I getting hurt? Ow! The hell is hurting me? Jeez, Louise. Okay. I have no idea what that was all about. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go. Before I get mysteriously hurt some more. Okay, we'll do one more warp. And then we'll call it a day. Let's take off here. Pull up in the old map. And see where we're going to warp to next. Okay, there we go. Um... And if I just go straight here, then that's probably gonna... Let's see. Yep, too far. Okay, we'll jump here first. Here we go. Doing a pulse jump. What the hell? Why is my ship spinning out of control? Okay, there we go. I've restabilized, and I'm in this new system. All right. Uh, ooh, there's like purple cracks all over this planet. And, alright, let's just go ahead and land on the planet. Shall we? What kind of planet is this? This is Ayan Kinjal. Ayan Kinjal. Ooh, it's kind of pretty. Okay, what do we have here? A bunch of purple rocks. Let's see. Let's go ahead and do a scan. Here we are. What do we have up right ahead? Oh, interesting. Okay. Here we go. Let's land here. Let's land here. Okay, it's a radioactive planet. Weather's reactive. Sentinel's passive. Flora copious. Fauna regular. All right. Copious amounts of flora. Pull out my old uh, tool here. Yeah, I haven't mined for a while, so, you know, I think this is where we're going to call it an end to the episode. 
Next episode, we'll explore this planet a little bit. And then we'll uh, do a warp drive. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Windows be opening. Can I get in there? And then we'll do a warp drive to the black hole. See where that black hole takes us. It's uh, apparently a shortcut. So we'll get closer to the galactic center. All right, here we are. Very nice. But anyway, guys, um, I hope you guys have been enjoying uh, No Man's Sky. It hasn't been getting the views that I would have hoped. And so, um, you know, if you guys are enjoying it, then go ahead and give it a like, favorite, share, and subscribe. Um, but, you know, if you guys aren't enjoying it, then, you know, I don't know how much longer I'm going to play this series, to be honest with you guys. So, um, if you do like it, tell your friends. Tune in, and uh, together we will find the Galactic Center. But if you don't, then, uh, you know, maybe I'll just have to go explore that kind of stuff on my own. 